Hello everyone, this is Nitin here. How you guys are doing? I hope your watercolor painting is going more smoothly. You are learning, you are improving day by day. And uh, my best wishes for, for your further learning of watercolor paintings. So today in this video, I will be talking about uh, the importance of uh, outdoor painting. we should go and do watercolor painting outside our home and how does it help you to improve your watercolor so i hope these points would help you to leverage your watercolor and uh, make you as a complete watercolor artist going outside and do your watercolor paintings so the primary reason why we should do plain air outdoor watercolor painting is because it eliminates your fear. So friends, now let's understand how does this help you. When you paint outdoor painting, you are exposed to that surrounding. People around you curiously looking at you and your artwork you are creating. But you as a creator consciously putting your effort to make your art. In this process, one very peculiar thing happens. So as you progress, your brush stroke become more mature, bold, and reflects fearless application of color. So after doing few paintings, you will observe your public fear goes away and you will feel more confident as an artist. So friends, I believe this approach makes you more matured and uh, it eliminates all your fear. So friends, I'll give you on a, some of the example which helped me. Uh, look at this painting. Uh, when uh, It's long back when I started doing plain air. So I saw some bit of uh, improvement, though it was not clear. Uh, but uh, I, when I was doing, I was feeling much better. Okay, uh, the reason because I was just not thinking so much. What I was doing is I was just watching the subject, and I wanted to make same as it is. Watercolor is all about how you eliminate your fear. Doing a bold strokes. So this was the first painting and after that I would just keep doing that. This was in my local area where I did uh, uh, one of the mall. So it was not so great but actually you know I, I started doing this and I was noticing that uh, my painting is actually improving. So this was the another one and after a certain time uh, it's really uh, going up. Look like, uh, okay, at this. So this was the another one which I did. Uh, it's all in my local area. Uh, then again, this. So I've, I've done several uh, plain air painting which helped me a lot uh, to make uh, you know fearless strokes and uh, uh, the overall composition and the color. And that's all about it. So the second reason you should do outdoor painting feel the color you need to feel the mood and the environment surrounding you and being an artist it's a remarkably important unless you'll not feel the mood and you'll not see the environment and that's the you know a, a biggest plus point doing outdoor you have to be very emotional you have to be very sensitive as an artist when you do outdoor painting it makes you it completes you as a as a complete artist as long as you are able to capture the essence of the environment you are painting it gives you a eminence pleasure okay and many of us are struggling uh, when you do it your home or your comfort zone when you do painting you'll have a, uh, you start thinking okay which color I have to use whether I should use this color or any any specific color but when you there on spot, you see the color, right? You see the color and you take a decision, okay? What color I should? You can see the, the reflection, the lights, the shadows in real time. And that gives you a lots and lots of possibilities to make your watercolor more effective. And that's the beauty of doing watercolor painting outside. The third point is the fearless brush strokes and speed. You know, this is very important. When you do a painting outside, let's take this example. 
the strokes because see the, there is no time for you you can't be there on a whole day and doing a one painting in out uh, in auto what you need to do is you need to complete your painting as fast as possible and that's the beauty the moment you start doing painting fast you'll see the strokes the 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 force of your strokes the force okay can you see the force of the strokes and that is what uh, you will gain if you start doing auto painting at the same time you'll have and how this force will come the force comes when you want to complete your painting as fast because the lights and shadows are rapidly changing okay you can memorize some of the thing but it's the really uh, important if you are making a painting you know where the light falls where the shadows falls and those things will help you the other aspect of uh, doing auto painting is building a community you'll be meeting a lot of new people lot of enthusiastic and like minded people the art lover they'll come to you and they'll ask you several question okay so what happens is you start communicating with them the people will know you so people have a curiosity to know you they wanted to know what all the paintings you have made what exactly do okay and it's not just about the interacting with the people it's like and you are you are establishing yourself as an artist to your community so doing the outdoor painting you will also uh, you know establishing yourself as a as an artist as a creative person among among your community or in your society uh, and that's the beautiful thing which you will be doing because you have to say very clear and loud that yes i am a artist and i do painting i love painting and uh, and that's about it otherwise uh, the people will never know you who you are and what you do the people are so busy it's a really important as a artist to let the people know what you do and this happens when you take your creativity your art to the to the common people so friends i want to take this opportunity to say thank you so much to all my patrons who has been helping me to create this uh, uh, watercolor tutorial uh there are several uh, patrons who has been helping me and uh, uh, guys this is uh, just because of you i was able to create uh, these uh, watercolor tutorials so i'll be giving digital version of this uh, painting to all my patrons uh this is just a small gift to them uh, but uh, i just wanted to say thank you to all my patron and uh, i look forward to have more patron who come forward and support my art so i can create a several watercolor tutorial so thank you so much uh, all of you uh, i really want to call out all the patrons name who has been helping me and uh, i'm so glad that uh, you guys came forward and uh, uh, supported my art So I request you to subscribe my channel and be my patron. I hope uh, you enjoy this video and I'll be coming at a new video very soon. Thank you so much for watching this video.